Here are the directions for comparing numbers using the symbols less than, greater than, or equal to. So the last couple weeks, last two weeks, we have been working on the number or the learning target. I can compare numbers using the symbols less than, greater than, and equal to. We've been working on comparing numbers for two weeks and we've been using these symbols. We used these symbols last week and this assignment is going to help you practice using the symbols to compare numbers. Okay. I will do this first one for you. So we, it says click and drag the sign that makes the number sentence true. This says 24 is then 45. So we have to fill in this blank with one of these symbols to make it true. I know that 24 is less than 45. So now I have to figure out which symbol to use. I know it's not this one because they're not the same. They're not equal. This one would, if I put this one here, this one, the alligator mouth is eating 24. Hmm, that doesn't seem right because I know the hungry alligator always wants to eat the biggest number. The greatest number here is 45. This symbol cannot be right. This symbol, let's try it. This one has the alligator mouth facing 45, which is true. The alligator eats the greatest number. So this is the right symbol. This says 24 is less than 45. That's true. We will do this one together in class. Again, you just click the symbol that goes with, that will make the number sentence true. Some have numbers in standard form like this, and some have numbers in their like say 10 way, or just broken down by tens and ones. So like one ten, three ones is greater than less than or equal to three tens, two ones. You have to figure that out by moving the symbol that makes the number sentence true. There are, let's see how many are you going to do. I just did that one for you. That one we'll do in class. And by yourself, you should do 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11 by yourself. And then submit it so I can give you feedback. I can't wait to see them.